the United States Communications Zone, Europe. An organization preoccupied with logistics, the military science of putting the right supplies in the right place at the right time. A million and one items of material, each item a problem in itself, and each handled smoothly with disciplined efficiency by the United States Communications Zone, Europe. I can truthfully state that Comzi operates a complex larger than any company in the world and does it with a speed and efficiency that is literally fingertip control. A precision, a depth of control which men may direct, but only the electronic memory banks of a computer brain can encompass. This is automatic data processing, the very core of Comzi's ability to respond instantly to requirements in the field. In seconds with automation, skilled operators can complete a bookkeeping job which not long ago took days to accomplish. And at night, when the workload is lighter, the same equipment produces a document known as the status report. Two inches in thickness, it is a complete, detailed evaluation of the entire Comzi supply inventory. It is equipment such as this that makes possible Comzi's pinpoint control of a million and more items of defense. The ceaseless hum of automation, maintaining stock levels, controlling the flow of orders from the field, routing equipment by the factory. Through a vast network of pipelines built by Comzi, flow millions of gallons of gasoline, aviation gas, jet fuel, diesel fuel. Together they form Comzi's largest single item of supply. One that demands a fuel distribution system of tremendous complexity and truly massive capacity. Huge control centers to direct the pipeline flow. Tank farms to provide working reserves. Pumping stations. distribution points. And automation to coordinate the routing of fuels to destinations all across free Europe. Comzi takes nothing for granted. Here, in its petroleum laboratory at Donge, all petroleum products are pre-tested for quality and performance. This is only one of many quality control laboratories, staffed and operated by Comzi. In the 305 Ramec, IBM has combined the power, speed, and flexibility of electronics required in the random access method of accounting and control. Here is a data processing machine that is beautifully designed, a machine whose compact integrated construction makes possible a multitude of operations. In addition to random or inline data processing, the 305 will serve us a flow of other information. 
This includes online printed documents and various types of punched card output. RAMAC also contains extensive facilities easily accessible for storing information. RAMAC requires a miracle memory. The 305 has it. Five million characters magnetically recorded on 50 disks revolving 1,200 times a minute. These 50 disks will hold as much information as 32 cartons containing 64,000 IBM cards. Input to RAMAC is by IBM unit record cards, fed in at up to 125 per minute. Each card is read, recorded, and checked. The magnetic process drum revolving 6,000 times per minute has recording tracks for stored program instructions, data storage, arithmetic functions, and inquiry data. Input and output tracks permit independence of input and output units. The magnetic core unit synchronizes the flow of data to and from each independent unit. These units, having different cycle rates, need a high-speed transfer storage device to avoid transmission delays. The magnetic core unit does the job. The address register pinpoints the location of information in disk storage. Each block of 100 characters has an address. The access arm, given any address, will locate the information with a random access average of six-tenths of a second. Data can be read or written from a stored program instruction or from a manual inquiry station. For the first time, IBM combines the stored program for data processing and the wired control panel for logic elements and control. All these components that we have just seen are housed within the trim gray process unit. Also compactly stored inside are miles of electronic circuiting, the very nerve network of the 305 RAMAC. To provide flexibility in data processing, the 305 is equipped with two output devices, an IBM unit record card punch and an online printing device capable of accepting information directly from RAMAC in readable form. This is made possible by a single type head engraved with alphanumeric characters. The magnetic structure of the characters on the output track selects and prints the type head. The device can turn out 80 lines per minute of 20 characters under wired format control. This is the operating control station of the 305 RAMAC. Here is displayed the instruction word that is being executed and the program step being performed. Operating signals and controls include program selector, program start, and program stop. Logic functions displayed are accumulator, selector, and compare status. Another important console feature is the ability to read current conditions in response to a manual inquiry. The inquiry station consists of an alphanumeric keyboard and an automatic electric typewriter. The operator must key the address of the desired 100 character record. Completion of the inquiry and presentation of the record to the automatic typewriter can be completed in less than one second. The typed inquiry response is again under wired format control. A forceful reminder of the 305's processing ability is the rapid display of instruction execution, faster even than the eye can follow. In modern business, where time is money, the 305 RAMAC has made bookkeeping a matter of split seconds. 